Hi Aries, welcome to your weekly video. I hope you guys are doing amazing. So thank you for tuning in. So let's see what's coming up in your energy Aries as the sun is now in Pisces. Pisces is the zodiac sign associated with the element of water, emotions, feelings, intuition, but also mystical, magical, imagination, fantasy, things that are not real, um, things that are in the mind, the imagination, create very creative energy, sensitive. It, it's all about what goes on on the inner side, the inner world. However, the sun enhances that energy of the 12th house. And we have, I believe Saturn just moved into the 12th house. So we have the discipline of Capricorn moving into the spiritual side of Pisces. So there could be a commitment to spirituality, um, anything that has to do with water energy, emotions, feelings, intuition. So let's see what we get here. Angels, spirits, guides. Wow. Starting off, we're getting... The, the Nine of Cups, the favorite card here. <laughs> so this is all about celebration, fun. Um, it is a water energy, so it has to do with the, the um, receiving rather than, you know, sort of taking action and going after something. This is allowing yourself to have a good time, have fun, you know, be happy, it's almost at the bliss. A lot of the time they say it's the wish card because there is something about a wish coming true for you. Okay, so it's the main energy of your week, which is definitely a good energy to have. So let's see what we get here. What else is coming in for Aries? Okay, so the challenge is Hangman, Major Arcana for... Standing still, waiting, um, just being in the moment. Uh, sometimes, well, it has to do with being able to see a situation from a different point of view than your own. Looking at it differently. Um, pausing, waiting, reflecting, having an epiphany. Being made to subdue. Being made to wait. Um, that's your challenge here. So let's see. What do we have? Ooh, okay. We have major arcana justice happening in your life. So justice represents a balancing. It is a major arcana, so it is celestial. Um, blessings coming to you, justice, balance coming into your life. The major arcana of justice is, in tarot, represents uh, Libra, which is public also. It can be what other people see from the outside looking in. So something here is about what's seen as balanced, fair, just, equal, um, in a partnership, um, in any kind of situation. It could be the application of law. Um, it could be um, courts, legal documents, settlements. So the root of the issue of why you're so happy is something's going to be made fair, just, balanced, equal in your life. Something that was out of whack. Now, in this case, the hangman probably means it's you've been waiting for this. You know, you've been, it's, it wasn't your choice to wait. You were told, just wait. <laughs> um, for Aries, that's usually not easy because you want something right away. You're ruled by Mars, which is the planet of action. So, you know, and it's okay. Um, let's see what we have here. Okay, we have a three of cups. We have shared emotions between people. Now, this is coming up as a past energy. There might be people around you that share the same feelings as you. There may have been a group you were dealing with. There may have been a group of friends or people you were dealing with. Um, could be any kind of class action. Okay, you are having goal achievement here with the Four of Wands, stabilization, the happy home, maybe taking some time off, 
Um, you know, four of wands means your ship has arrived. It is the energy of going after something and then and then it, the ship arrives and it's here. So it's also about stability, keeping things in your life stable. It's the energy typically of a fire, stable fire, sort of like an eternal flame, just kind of burning. It's stable. It's not out of control. Um, wow. Okay, so you have a gift, an opportunity, a new beginning, ace of the coins. This is celestial in that it is a gift. Um, it is an opportunity. It is an option. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, usually something money can buy. But it can also be in the form of a letter or a contract that comes in that represents stabilization, forms or documents, money that is stable, things that are practical and real in your life. Um, okay, so in my opinion, the aces are, well, they say all aces in tarot come from this energy of the dragon um, the dragon constellation that is above the North Pole, which is called Draconis, I believe. So the constellation Draconis is where the aces are. Aces of Ace of Cups, Scorpio, and they're fixed sign energies. So the aces are the fixed sign because it's here, it's not going anywhere. You can take it, you can leave it. It's take it or leave it. But with an earth element energy, it's usually something right in front of you, tangible. You can pick it up. It's money, you could purchase it, or it's a document or a contract that is equal to money. So this could be a settlement in your favor. It could be a letter that you receive. Okay, it shows here something you've been waiting for, pushing for, trying to get. Yeah, so now you have another celestial um, ace of water so you have very powerful feelings coming in um ace of the cups okay so we'll just put this over here okay and what else wow look at this week ed for you aries this is the amazing victory this is overcoming a difficult situation coming out on top um totally a victory um you're being seen and recognized. There could be something of an of a hero type of energy or at least a winner. Um, confidence in yourself. Good reputation. You didn't give up. Nine of Wands. It's like you kept going. You didn't quit. So the root of the issue is justice. So you're getting justice coming in. Something being made fair, balanced, equal. Major Arcana, Celestial Energy. And then you have minor arcanas, but you do have a major arcana. You were meant to wait. You were meant to see this situation from a different point of view. It wasn't meant to happen like immediately. And the main energy of your week is the nine of cups, the wishes that come true, the emotional satisfaction. It is a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpio energy. Okay, so you end up with a fire. You end up with a fire energy, which is winning, victorious. Okay, but it is backed up by something real. So this isn't just the striving and the struggling. This is you achieve what you set out to achieve. You get this Ace of Pentacles. You get the gift, the opportunity. Um, and you will feel, in a sense, like this is, you feel justified. Okay, so let me pull an Oracle card from, I'll use the Kipper. Okay. Okay, so you have a very successful week ahead of you. Um, Jupiter and Aries is direct. It has to do with a lot of who you are, your identity, who you are personally. Um, Venus is transiting through the 12th house. So keep your thoughts positive, your ideas positive, pleasurable. Um, do things that you have affinity for, things that you like. Um, you know, you know, don't be afraid to treat yourself. Okay, so show us Aries here. Okay, child. Okay, 
Something about child. Children, child, childhood. Okay, childhood poverty. Okay, some of you may have gone through a struggle in your life early, earlier. Um, oh, wow. Okay, so we have here a message of concern. And then we, it's someone at a desk looking like a lawyer. And then we have here the court card of adjudication. So there's something here about um, something being worked out by a, a neutral third party. Could be a lawyer. Oh, wow. We have the pathway out of the light or into the light. I always say out of the light, into the light. Um, the pathway into the light and out of some kind of struggle. There is a journey. And what else here for Aries this week, please? What else for Aries this week? Okay, something here about toil and labor. It could be something to do with employment. Anything to do with something you worked very hard at. Um, oh, wow. So we got the sudden wealth card. Some of you are coming into... It's symbolic. These are gypsy tarot cards. Shows privileged woman on the bottom, but... Symbolic of great wealth, sudden wealth, is, you know, receiving something of great value to you that holds a lot of value. And it could be money because you do have the ace of coin here. You also have the reputation. So the sudden wealth is bringing in also something about reputation is good. Victory, you're overcoming, you're being seen and recognized as a hero as a winner, as a successful person. There is something here coming in about goal achievement, something where you were striving, going, looking towards the future, and it arrives. So the privileged woman is here, and I'm just going to leave this here for your weekly message, Aries. Thank you so very much for watching my channel, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, Aries.